This is Jonathan Pajot. Welcome to the Symbolic World. All right, everybody. Uh, I am back with Jonathan Pajot on his own channel, interviewing him about a very important event coming up that you're going to want to know all about. Was that a good intro, Jonathan? That was, that was <laughs> perfect. Right. Great, great. Okay, here we go. So what are we talking about today? And so we are talking about the Symbolic World Summit. We, you know, this is something that has been kind of floating around for a long time. We might have done it already if it wasn't for COVID, but now we, we're going to do it. And so Neil, he came back to me and he was, we have to, we have to get together in person. You have to, you keep saying that we have to meet in person with people and not just meet online. And so let's do this. Yeah, I totally agree. Well, every time we've gotten together in person, this is something that's come up and we've talked about because it's got to be one of the most requested things around uh, the symbolic world is an actual in-person conference. It's long overdue. So we're looking at here, I'm looking at the dates. We're looking at 2024, February 29th through the 2nd in Tarpon Springs, Florida. Now, if you're not familiar with Tarpon Springs, let's talk about that a little bit. Have you ever been, Jonathan? No, I've never been to Tarpon. Okay, Spring. at one point, it was the sponge capital of the world, which is one of his strange claims to fame. Well, but when it comes to sponge diving and the Greek technique of sponge diving, it became such a popular spot that uh, it, it is now the, um, I guess it's the largest Greek population per capita in the United States. So there's a number of Orthodox church there and, and Greek people there. And there's a wonderful church called St. Nicholas. Um, they had a weeping icon of St. Nicholas in the 1970s. You can actually see that if you come. And uh, the town has got some of the best Greek food, and it's got a wonderful conference center. So it uh, it felt like the ideal location when we were talking with the uh, promoters because it's so close to all the parks in Orlando. It's close to beaches in Clearwater. It's close to Tampa. There's lots of airports, lots of places to stay, easy to get in, some of the most incredible eating in Florida. Uh, which is saying a lot. So I think it's, uh, you know, it just makes perfect sense because who doesn't want to come to Florida uh, late February, February, early March? Where right? we are, yeah, especially if you're from Canada. Okay. And so and so we, we, we bounce it around and we have a theme. It's called Restoring the Cosmic Image. I love and basically it. we are, we feel like we're at this point of re-enchantment. You know, we feel like things are kind of moving in that direction and it's becoming possible again to recapture a more embodied and more connected vision and participation in the world. So we're going to try to explore that together. All the all the the people that are coming, we have some amazing speakers. Do you want to announce some of the speakers, Neil? Oh, I do. Uh, well, you can tell us about them. So we have, uh, first off, we're going to go with Martin Shaw. Now, for those people who don't know Martin Shaw, you're going to love him. So if you've been following the channel and you haven't seen Martin on the channel or speaking with Jonathan, uh, Jonathan, like what is his what is his real like title? Like he's an, he's an actual mythographer, which means that he he's a Stanford professor of mythology, but he is also someone who like lives in the woods for months at a time and and uh, and does all these crazy things. He's he's an amazing storyteller. His stories are wonderful. He's he really is that ancient kind of storyteller. He he used to do a version of the of the Odyssey in nine days, where he would tell the story for like nine days straight, and he was able to keep people's attention. He said half of the people would go crazy, and then the other half would just be completely like locked in. Uh, and so he's an amazing storyteller. We've already did some we did some events in in England and in Ireland together, and we have a a really great rapport. And we have a lot of sparks that fly when we when we exchange, we discuss. So he's gonna he's gonna talk, and then the but, big. Well, he's well, you know, just to interrupt you. I'm cutting in. No, uh, I when I've heard him talk, like the way he illuminates things, and like how excited I get as an artist and someone who thinks like this, it's it's almost like he's impossible. It's like I didn't know there was a person like him or a person could be that committed to this and that engaging on the subject. So I, that when you when you mentioned him, I thought that was like the most perfect fit. And so the second speaker uh, is the one that a lot of people from the symbolic world are going to be excited about. We have Father Stephen DeYoung, who is going to come speak to us. And that is going to be that's going to be amazing. So I'm really excited to have him be there exchanging with all the symbolic world people, exchanging with me, exchanging with Neil. Ex you know, have you met Father Stephen? Not yet. No, I, uh, I tease him online. That's about it. Uh, 
It's incredible. I mean, the Lord of Spirits podcast is just got to be one of my favorite podcasts, period. Uh, the stuff Father Stephen knows and the way he articulates it, I feel like what I learned from him sometimes is like stuff I thought I was going to have to wait, you know, to get to paradise to ask God about. And like Father Stephen can illuminate some of these things. So, I mean, that's a quite a setup, I'm sure. But uh, I mean, I don't think anyone's going to be disappointed to meet him or even ask them their own strange questions about giants in person. In person. So Martin, Sean, Father Stephen, they're going to be the headlining speakers with myself. And then we're going to have all these different paths for different types of people. And uh, so there'll be like main events with everybody together. And then we'll also have paths for artists that will be headed up uh, by our friend Neil right here. Yeah, I'm excited to do that. I, I've invited Vesper Stamper. If you guys are familiar with Vesper, uh, she's, uh, I guess you could call her a Renaissance woman. Uh, she's quite a raconteur herself as as far as storytelling. Um, she's a visual artist. She was been, she's was she been a musician and she's a, a well-published author. Um, and so we're going to tag team that event and hopefully help artists answer some of the toughest questions they've been asking, which is how do I in integrate the symbolic thinking and symbolism into my storytelling? How do I integrate it into my artwork? Uh, we're gonna. I'm gonna answer questions like that, and we're gonna go on even to more practical stuff uh, about publishing your work, finishing your work, getting it out there. All uh, right. So then yep. we have another path, which was going to be the universal history path. With everybody knows who's going to be doing that. It'll be Richard Rowland, and he will have someone too. But we don't know. He might have someone helping him out, but we're not sure who yet. And then we have a third path, which is going to be. What is the third path called? It's like. It, you guys had mentioned it. It's, it's about grounding symbolism in the home and in your yeah. life. It's something to do with the hearth. Like yeah, the, so like how to integrate symbolism into your actual life. Well, there's another thing going on the very first night we get there. That is the biggest, that is the biggest thing that's going to happen. That has me the most excited. So what is it? Well, uh, you know, so we are g getting back on the road, Dirt Poor Robbins, and we're going to do our release show uh, on February 29th, the very first night, Leap Year. Leap year. We're going to take the leap and we're going to do a concert of the symbolic world, um, releasing our new completed record, Firebird. And so that's amazing. So we have the chance to see Drupal Robbins in concert, first time ever. Like my kids, they told me they want to come now to this event just because of that. They didn't want to come before, but when they found out that Drupal Robbins is playing at the Symbolic World Summit, they're like, Dad, we got to go to Florida. So so that is really exciting. So you got to be there in person to see it. There's no other way to see it. Uh, we're not doing a ton of touring next year. So we've got a couple of shows leading up to that one and a few shows afterwards. But that's probably going to be our, one of our bigger events of the year. All right. So we're looking at, you know, around 500 people. It, there's maybe a little possibility for a, a few more. We've got VIP tickets and then we've got regular tickets. Uh, people, if you want some of those VIP tickets, you definitely have to come in early because those are going to go really fast. Uh, and it's going to be a great time also just to meet people from the symbolic world, meet people in, in person, uh, people that are have been on my channel, people that have had me on their channels. It's going to be, the, I think it's going to be great to actually to, to just be there with and have sit around a table and talk to people. Right now, is there going to be like a social channel on the website? Because I know you have some uh, pretty cool social features uh, for people to interact on your website, which I which I would recommend leading into the concert, a uh, concert conference and concert and uh, concert as well. Yeah, so I'm people can sign up to the symbolicworld.com. We have a community there that is thriving. We have amazing things going on already, discussions about novels. So on the community right now, we're already having the Beowulf course. We also have a course on C.S. Lewis. And the Space Trilogy by Annie Crawford. There's going to be a course on metaphysics coming with J.P. Marceau. So it's really the place to already rev up your relationships, get to know people, get a sense of who's coming, so that so that once we arrive, we're already we're ready to discuss and ready to exchange and to and to get to know each other. Perfect. I'm looking forward to seeing everybody too. I've been interacting with in person, uh, so many people. So the event details again are February 29th through March 2nd. This is 2024. It's in Tarpon Springs, Florida. Tickets are on sale now. You can find a link in the description of this video. Um, I don't know what else to say. Tarpon is a wonderful area again. Like I'm going to put a map up right now. Look at how close you are to everything else you want to do in Florida while you're here. So just make it a trip. Come down and hang out with us. It's going to be incredible. All right. See you there.